all these other kids absolute ass hats. You are definitely my favourite. I'm so sorry that you can't do this messy activity, but your mum doesn't want to get your $80 shirt and your Nike Airs dirty. Go and sit in the corner and play with a dinosaur or something. There is nothing I would love more than for you to ax yourself on that handrail, but I don't want to fill out a whole incident report. Sarah won't be your best friend. Well, I kind of don't blame her because I wouldn't be your best friend either because you're a spoiled little bitch. Well, maybe if you didn't provoke him, he wouldn't have hit you in the head with a truck. I don't have time for that. Calm as a bitch. No, I don't know where your child's sock is. It's probably hidden with his drink bottle. Or maybe you'll just find it in the back of your car and then not tell me and apologize for blaming me personally. Jimmy just full on did a backflip off the swing. <laughs> oh man, I wish I was filming that because that's hilarious. Oh look, it's little Mary wearing the same clothes she was wearing yesterday. I can definitely smell that you didn't have a bath last night. Okay friends, it's lunch time, which means you can't have gluten, you can't have dairy, you can't have strawberries for some reason and your parents are vegan and are forcing you into veganism so how about I serve you some lettuce all oh, right so you want me to keep this whole room clean while looking after 15 toddlers all by myself while you take another staff member out of the room because I can handle it <laughs> yeah okay I can totally do that, yeah. <laughs> okay, bit too much love here. Personal bubble. Okay, guys, I know that your parents don't really love you that much. They keep bringing you into daycare in the middle of a pandemic because they're essential workers. I'm not sure selling things for Avon is essential, but here we are. Oh, yes, of course I can stay back. It's not like I have my own family and children to look after. Oh my God, you're the fussiest child on earth. Just eat the damn food. Fine, just starve. Oh, you've wet your pants, have you, Ryan? What a surprise. It's only the 15th time today. I'm sorry, Karen, but teething is not a good excuse for your child to be biting chunks out of the same child every day. How about I bite him back and see how he likes it? Oh shit, here comes Jaden and his parents. Oh, they never shut up. Um, I'm just gonna pop to the toilet, guys, so I'll see you guys when they leave. You're gonna be a big sister. Wow, I can't imagine why she would want more children. I mean, honestly, you guys are little shits. You don't feel sick? Yep, definitely sick. I think that we're gonna have to call mummy to come pick you up because you're a little shit and I cannot stand you for the rest of the day. Jared must have a poo. Oh, quick, go away. I better go change his pooey nappy because that's definitely what stinks. She's like, what? 24? What is this? Her sixth kid? Far out. You guys need to buy a TV. 